right, what's up, guys? We are back with another Pool Trick Podcast episode. Today's very exciting. We got my girlfriend, Skylar Green. Hello. How are you, honey? Hi. I'm doing good. Today was a great day. <coughs> it was rainy. We got Labu earlier. It was hailing. Oh, yeah. It was I crazy. forgot it was actually hailing. But if you guys are new, please subscribe um, and today is i'm very excited because i've been ha- wanting to have skylar on for a long time um <laughs> we're, we're approaching our two month yeah on the 24th um officially mm-hmm. like a- if a- everyone who knows us are like they're always like yeah right because yeah like we've been hanging like, out yeah for so much longer but like a year right almost and we met if you guys don't know we met actually at the same workplace yeah job, we met at work which is very funny mm-hmm. yeah we met at work <laughs> very funny um skylar has done one podcast you've done one episode yeah. but this is like the redemption episode we were joking because we were both <laughs> a little bit tipsy right and then mm-hmm. what else just tired we were very tired that day really like tired. i remember it, we but did it super late like at like 10 yeah. at night we were falling asleep so yeah. we were like loopy we tipsy. were tipsy and yeah. we and we barely knew each other yeah it was like just uncomfortable like we just like didn't know each other yeah you know? so it was like well how close we are now guys compared to yeah. when we filmed the first one is like night and day like, so you could feel the tension <laughs> yeah you could feel the tension you're right um yeah. so i'm very excited to have you on finally and this will be a great episode guys mm-hmm. you can kind of I don't know. Maybe you can see what type of person I am based off my girlfriend, or I bet people are just hella curious of what my girlfriend is like—the the pull trig CEO and host. <laughs> um, but we have tons of amazing topics, guys, to get into, and we're also just gonna like take a chill approach. Uh, yeah, it fucking hailed today. Yeah. I haven't seen hail in a long there time. There was a double rainbow. Yeah, there was a double rainbow too. Yeah. It was like a very nice Labu date. Yeah. We go on many Labu dates. The yeah. fucking tomato bisque yeah. is the best. Right? Yeah. And their bread. Yeah. It's Especially when it's raining. Yeah. yeah. It's like A tier. We were mm-hmm. saying how soft it was. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Best bread. Yeah, we like barely knew each other when we did the first podcast. Well, yeah. not barely, but like we were only a few months in friends. Like we did it too prematurely, I think. Yeah. Like, it was too soon. <laughs> yeah. Okay. It was like Should we jump into our first topic? Or? Okay. Okay. Um, well, first, let's talk about like where you're from, in case people don't know. So, where are you um, from? I was born in Sacramento, and Not I was Folsom, raised in right. Folsom. Yeah, yeah, raised in Folsom. I yeah. was raised in Folsom since I was um, eight or nine, and yeah. Yeah. So we That's both. We both are raised in Folsom. Mm-hmm. I was the only difference yeah. I wasn't born in Sac. Yeah. We went to the same high school. Same high school and FHS. We didn't know each other. You were two years below me, so yeah. I didn't even like know you. Yeah. Um we did we did not know each other at all. <laughs> but I remember like the last when you were almost a junior and when I was almost graduating, I do remember seeing you at the football games because Sky did cheer. Mm-hmm. Yeah. <laughs> What was it like doing cheer? Like looking back, it was do you? Fun. Yeah, you miss it. Um, I don't like miss it, but I like. It was fun. Yeah, like, I loved it. Yeah, like but, you, you look back on it as you're glad you did it. Yeah, and you, you did like it, right? Yeah, That's it was nice. really fun. I loved it. I love, like, being part of a team and stuff. It's fun. Did you like the, the sport aspect of it? Like you know, just yeah. like being tossed and stuff yeah, like that what do you fun. call the position you were or? flyer okay flyer yeah. i don't even know if it's, it's are fun. they called positions yeah like football no, or uh, roles yeah, they're called or what do they say like your stunt position oh okay yeah yeah that's so cool <laughs> so okay so yeah that's kind of the background um if you had no idea where skyler's from <laughs> so i think it's so funny and yeah we met at work and we have to mention that, like, for the first eight months of working yeah, together. Yeah, we didn't even talk to each other, introduce ourselves to each other. Like, 
Nothing. anything. Like we didn't, we yeah, <laughs> basically didn't funny. fucking like speak a single word. Yeah. It's really funny. Yeah. We're like just judge a book by its cover. Yeah. We judged each but, other. Like I only worked mornings and you only worked nights. So we like only saw each other. each other in passing. Yeah. I remember that. So, uh, yeah. You were only mornings. Yeah. <laughs> That's so funny. <laughs> yeah, we didn't, we would, yeah, we would like, I don't know. And then the funniest thing about our, our relationship, the unique thing about it is the aspect of how we ignored each other at first. And then once we slowly be- started becoming friends, we like, were in denial of how much we liked each other. Yeah. Definitely. Like a lot. We were so immature and... That's like so unique. I don't know. It was very funny. But anyways, first we should just do a first topic right away. Uh, Topics. So, oh yeah. How did, in your words, uh, I'll let Skylar answer this and shut up. How did we become a thing from your perspective? Like, how did we just like become a relationship? If you had to briefly, like, shortly wrap it up, like, to someone, let's say. Um, we were, like, friends with the same, pe- like, a couple of the same people. So, like, we started all hanging out together. And then, yep. um, and then, like, you just invited me to go do something one day. And then I was like, To okay. hang out. Yeah. Yep. And then we just started hanging out all the time. Yeah. And that's, that's pretty basically m- what happened. That's pretty much, yeah. <laughs> and, well, we would hang out more and more like it became yeah. until it was like 24 7 yeah and it was just like yeah 24 7 <laughs> lots of tanning <laughs> lots oh, of yeah. tanning when we're that was our like thing. early into it you mm-hmm. know um, paddle boarding yeah paddle boarding very fucking fun oh, activity so much if you guys boarding. are in a relationship right now like i mean we love it and uh, okay super random but <laughs> recently we got into tennis bitch tennis Tennis is great. Why do yeah. you like tennis, t- Sky? I love tennis because first, it's such a good workout. Like, you don't have to get dirty. Like, it's on a court. It's pretty clean, you know? Yeah, for the There's, most part. Yeah. And um, it's just such good exercise. Like, I feel so good after doing it, and you can feel, like, how much stronger you get. Me too. And I love the little tennis outfits. <laughs> yeah, they're great, yeah. And it, the funniest thing and most ironic thing is that Skylar and I were, like, the fucking last people you would expect. Yeah. Like, we're, like, yeah. the stoner, burnout, kind of artistic type. Yeah, but we love tennis. <laughs> yeah, we do. We fucking love it. I miss it. It's been raining like every day, so we haven't yeah. been able to play. But yeah. yeah, I hope there's like an indoor. I don't think there's like an indoor tennis court that we can go to. Yeah. But I mean, not for as soon as it's not raining, you, you guys already know what we're going to be yeah, doing. Yeah, it's on. Yeah. Okay. Um. So what's it like dating Owen Duff? For people who don't know, what's it like dating me? Um, from your words, from the the baby well, mommy. Well, it's great. <laughs> yeah. It's great most of the time. I, I mean, hope so. It's amazing. Okay. You're my favorite boyfriend. <laughs> my favorite person ever. Yeah. Yeah. I know that. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, very nice. Yeah. Thank you so you're much. My favorite. And you're my favorite. Um, I thought. I started dating this thing because of how chill you are as a person. <laughs> so, yeah, I have no complaints. Like, um, I didn't even want a boyfriend. We both and, didn't want. Yeah, we didn't want to be in a relationship, and we, like, denied yeah. it. And then we were just denying it, and it, yeah. like, just... It just, like... It was natu- undeniable. It like, was undeniable, you know. <laughs> and it naturally <laughs> happened with us even trying yeah. to... We didn't... We both... We were resisting want a relationship. it and it still happened. Yeah, we so both like, like wanted to be single. Like it was like a sign. Like it was like undeniable. We had signs yeah. that were very <laughs> magical that I won't tell them about. It's our thing. Yeah. Bitch. Sorry guys, <laughs> that secret won't be those beans yeah. will not be spilled. Um, this is great. I feel like if you're listening to this is a great pod because we're going to try, I'm going to try to make it relevant to like relationships, right? Cause like 
you're the love of my life, obviously. Like, Aww. you're the guest I wanted to on, have on. I wanted to have Skyler on for the longest time. I kept annoying you. Yeah, we're in love. <laughs> yeah, we're in love. We're sharing a coffee. You're the only guest I can call baby and, yeah. and drink the same drink. From yeah. And, yeah. Okay. <laughs> it's I'm just so fired up. It's going to be great. Um, okay, next one. In in your opinion, babe, what do you think? What, How is a relationship healthy? Like, what makes a great, healthy, fun, romantic relationship? I and, think, If like, you can put it briefly. Like, um, trying new things and communicating with each other and being honest with each other and just, like... Um, being true to yourself, like knowing, like telling them how you really feel, you know? Yeah. Being honest. Yeah, I couldn't agree more. Um, that's um, great advice. Th- yeah. Those are all the, I think you. And loyal, the, loyalty. Of course, yeah. yeah. Loyalty, honesty. Obviously. Being, being real with each other yeah. at all moments. I think that's yeah. the biggest thing. Just uh, Yeah. Yeah. Just at all yeah. times. I think we have all those. I couldn't agree more. <laughs> uh, <laughs> We well at all times we have I feel like just transparent communication like we just our souls connect like that like we're on the same yeah I, it's, I would always it's tell creepy. people yeah it's 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 just like it was crazy when it started yeah. happening yeah but I always tell people that we kind of we're on the same vibe yeah the frequency yeah we are yeah definitely, definitely. okay let's see um why why do you think we work well dating each other. Um, because we're kind of, like, opposites. Like, my pros are your cons, and, like, exactly. vice versa. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Because, yeah, like, my pros are each your other. Cons. Yeah. Yeah. And I feel like, well, I feel like, yeah, we definitely have our differences, and we're pretty opposites, but I think we're also very similar, right? Like at the yeah. same time and so we're it's very like, similar yeah we're like yin yang it's just everything yeah, yeah we're very similar i like that comparison yeah oh oh this was a good one that you were excited about date ideas for couples if they're bored or just oh. fun ideas for people to like say we got to do this like yeah to whoever they're dating hmm we love paddle boarding yeah what else like just doing stuff outside is like just fun nature Stuff. Yeah, like have a picnic. Hikes. Yeah, like go on a hike. Just go to the lake. Yeah. Yeah, to the river, like ocean. Um, try to try to find or try to experiment, guys. If you're dating someone and you're looking for stuff to do, try to try different sports. Try running. You never yeah. know if you like hiking, tennis. We yeah. thought we thought we wouldn't enjoy tennis, and then we were like, we love it. Yeah. What's the most fun dates do you think we've been on? Ooh. Um, probably. I loved the zoo. Oh. I loved. Yeah. Uh, I think that was one of my favorites. Yeah, the zoo. We love museums, art museums. Yeah, the zoo. We went um, to the Crocker together, right? Yeah, we went to the Crocker. That was nice. Mm-hmm. <laughs> uh, we love museums art museum in sacramento if you and know, like the yeah if we go to like galleries and stuff lots of galleries yeah we, uh, we go into cute little like pop uh not pop-up stores but like just private businesses little family mm-hmm. businesses like mm-hmm. we love that oh we thrift shops oh that yeah that takes up most of our time like, yeah we love we love it. We're so fucking yeah. into it. Yeah. Yeah. We just Why do you like find new things? So because it's like a treasure hunt. Yeah. It's so fun. Like, you never know what you're going to find. Exactly. I was about it's to say like that. It's like luck. I was about to say It's that. like... And it's fate. Yeah. When you find the perfect thing yeah. for your life, it's like, what? It like, lo- it's like so easy to just like walk right past something. Like, because right. there's so much stuff going there's on. So much it's stuff. so much clutter. So like... Yeah, when you find something good, it's like it feels more re- rewarding. Yeah, definitely. Yeah, yeah I couldn't agree more. That's yeah. great. I, I, we love Goodwill. Yeah. 
yeah good, good mm-hmm. food. we find like the cool i have this shirt is from goodwill yeah. so thrift shopping and I, i'm like super into clothes if you guys don't know like right like that's um clothing is a part of pool trig so it interests me so much mm-hmm. uh, you're so good at dressing too so are you what what would you describe your like drip like um, it just changes every day. Yeah, you're kind of into everything. Yeah. Skylar dresses. I don't really like, have, like, one... Style. Style. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I kind of... She owns... I mix you it up. every style and own it. I mix it up. I have, like, bits of pieces of everything. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Okay. Yeah. Um, <laughs> let's see here. Yeah. So, okay, so we're both very artistic, I think. And I didn't know you were artistic. Like, what? what's your thoughts on that? Do you think you uh, are? I feel like you're more artistic than I am. <sighs> I feel like you're just as much, but... Well, I think I'm artistic, humble. too, but... I don't know. Did you always... Did you draw as a kid or anything? Yeah. Yeah? Mm-hmm. But, like, you weren't super into painting or anything or, like, drawing... I like, I love doing art and stuff. Yeah, I feel like you love it. Mm-hmm. And you're, because she made, you made me that b- birthday card for my last birthday when I turned 23. And you like, she drew it with color mm-hmm. pencils. And I was like, what? Like, you shocked me <laughs> with how good you were at art. I feel like it was like held in. I was like, what? I was like blown away. I oh. was very good. Thank and you. Skylar is in an, she you have like incredible skill for interior design. Oh, I feel like. thank and you. arrangement. Thank definitely. you. <laughs> like if they saw your room they would be like, "Wow, Aww. that's dope." Thanks. Yeah. Do you see I, like do you see yourself getting a job like that maybe, possibly? Maybe. I don't know. I like doing it. Yeah. I enjoy it. Would you when and how did you get into plants? If you guys don't know, one of Skylar's hobbies, big um, hobby, <laughs> is plants. I got my first plant in like 2019. I think my mom my mom has a lot of plants, and my dad has a lot of plants too. So your parents have always been always into it. Yeah. Same with my things. Yeah. So I don't know. Like I got my first one with my mom, and then I just, just yeah. I loved having them around. Yeah. They are like, I feel like they're just nice to have around, yeah. you know? Like their energy. They brighten, just... yeah, they brighten the mood, you know? Yeah, they make you f- more, feel more yeah. human, kind yeah, of. Yeah, they do. So right away, like, you knew you were, oh, I'm going to get into this. Like, I want tons of plants all up mm-hmm. in my room. Yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> yeah. I mean, and you got me into plants. That's what's crazy. <laughs> it was contagious. Like, yeah. you, I was like, and I wasn't into plants at all. Like, you know. Yeah. And so, you just got I me love into them. them. I love them. Yeah, I here. love them. Yeah. And I have all of my plants because of this woman right here. So, <laughs> like, yeah. let me tell you. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Oh, both of our eyes are green. Oh. Uh-huh. Random fact. Uh, both of our eyes are green. You guys can't tell. <laughs> we always joke that we wanted we always knew we wanted to uh produce more green eyed people. Yeah. Reproduce some green eyed babies. <laughs> people always tell us our babies would be gorgeous. Yeah. So maybe one day. Maybe who knows what the future holds. In a long time. Um yeah, a long time. <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> let's see. Oh yeah. What's it like so you have one sister basically f- like that you see very often yeah. like in your immediate family yeah um and also what's it like being the first grandchild in skylar's family i like it i think it's nice well, because i have my family is really big 14 or 15 grandparents yeah like quite a few and hella little cousins right? yeah a lot of a well, lot of the cousins oldest cousin. i'm the oldest cousin yeah. i'm the first grandchild so there's just tons. Yeah, yeah tons. Yeah. Well, you, well uh, honey, you would always tell me and stuff that all the grandparents, like, kind of side with you the most because you're the oldest. So they relate 
to the oldest like grandkid the most, right? Is that why you think they like go to you? They all love you. Maybe because that's what you told me. Um, <laughs> A little. <laughs> shout out your sister. Yeah. Your younger sister. Little Haley. Haley, and she's almost a bulldog. I know. Yeah. Yeah. Next Folsom, year. FHS, and I'm, I'm sure it's an even bigger high school ever since. I we know left. it is. Like, it's, probably, it's gotten bigger. It's, it's like it's... absurd how many kids go there. It's like yeah, <laughs> but honestly, she's fine because all of her friends are gonna go there. All yeah. the friends she has right now are gonna go there with her. Yeah, that's really good. Yeah, that's great. Um, so oh, let's talk about the differences between like my family and yours, because yeah, I will. Because um, I want to marry you. <laughs> I'm not going to propose right now on the podcast, but you know that. Um, so she already about did. That. You already did. <laughs> to explain it and like answer it for me. If, for people, like, w- what makes your family different than mine? Why don't you explain it? Okay. Okay, I can explain it. Um, I feel like my family is like very um, traditional and there's n- divorce is rare and then in yours divorce is pretty common yeah um there's a lot of divorces yeah. and and yeah and by Stuff the way like, like no opinion on that and no judgment and every family is different and um you know it it doesn't downplay like mine isn't better than yours or the world's or you know yeah of course not yeah of course but... not yeah I just have a lot more family members. Yeah. It's more fun. I think it's better. Not, I mean, not that one is better, but I'm not. You like it. I yeah, like it the you way like it your is. Family. Yeah. Yeah. I love your family. I get along more, with them. Yeah. Yeah, I like it. Yeah. Well, that I, there you go. That's like um, a huge difference. You just come from a giant family, and mm-hmm. mine's like much smaller. But mine's like quite a. Mine's pretty small, I guess, compared to most. I don't know. I mean, I do have a lot of cousins, but yeah, it's not very... Because there's not divorces, there's a lot less people. It's just like, you know, just mostly the family tree, uh, just because it's not that common. So those are the differences, kind of. Yeah. Uh, We've already met quite a lot of family. Well, I mean, you only (laughs) met my immediate just because most of them are like in Ireland. Yeah. Yeah, but I met most of Skylar's family yeah. uh, by now, and I love them. <laughs> yeah. And Thanksgiving and Christmas are coming up, too. Mm-hmm. So that's very fun. Very exciting. Very exciting. Um, oh, places you want to take me and go together with. Oh, I want to go to Fort Bragg. Yes, Fort Bragg. Uh, I think I was there once with my parents. You've been there many times, right? been there like twice twice oh okay i want to go to new york with you yes where do you want to go um definitely new york uh i want to go to la with you the most yeah Yeah. um it's just like so expensive to travel right now too Mm -hmm. because of gas Mm -hmm. like that would be insane to drive to la but la definitely fort bragg i would love um maybe oh the redwoods yeah that would be those are awesome because yeah. some of those trees I love are ones. really old yeah, yeah. that's and a good one it's the tallest trees in the world i want to say probably i think so i think so i think in so. oregon and all right are they in oregon and washington both maybe i'm not too sure <laughs> i need to study up we both Got tattoos, we believe, the second oh, yeah. time we're hanging out. How did yeah. that happen? Explain to people. Um, <laughs> we were drinking, obviously. We yeah. went to um, well, we have dinner drank. at We kind of this... don't drink now, by the way. I just yeah, we, don't dr- we haven't been drinking for like a month. Yeah. And I think it's We gonna... drank the most when we first met, and then we slowly yeah. grew out of it together, which yeah. is dope. So we do not... Like yeah, change. we like I we haven't, haven't had any. Time. Yeah. So we've been so good. Yeah, we have been good. But sorry to yeah. interrupt. So um, how did that <laughs> happen? We're just both down. You think? Wait, what was I talking about? The tattoos. On the, oh yeah. Like, so did... we were drinking and we went to dinner across the street from the tattoo shop. And we were and in then, Sacramento. Yeah, right? we were in downtown Sacramento and we were getting. 
Yeah, we had a lot of liquid courage, and we got tattoos. Yeah. At the same time. Yeah. Yeah. It was very fun. It was fun. And uh, then she got cherries. I got yeah. the thing. Maybe we'll <laughs> pop up a photo of yeah. our tattoos. Yeah. So, so they know. Good idea. Yeah. I think that's so funny. And they're going to age together, like, exactly the same. Yeah. That's a wild activity to do the second time hanging out with someone, though. Yeah. <laughs> we were just, like, high on life and wanted to ball anyway. out and just get uh-huh. in together. Yeah. We were just, like, yeah, we're fun people. We're in the moment. I mean, I think. I love that. Yeah. Super in the moment. Mm-hmm. That's, like, your motto. <laughs> like. Um, we're enjoying a coffee, too, by the way. Yep. Peppermint. We love, uh, we like always do oat milk in our coffee. Fuck yeah. Dairy. Or almond milk. Yeah. What's your favorite coffee place? Hmm. What are some of your favorites? You love Paws, um, Sociology. We go to I Dutch, like, we go to um, Starbs. Temple. Temple's yes. good. Temple. I like Phil's. Phil's is really good, yeah. Sociology is good. Scooters is cool, too. I like Scooters. Yeah, we should go to Scooters. Scooters coffee. Scooters. Okay. Um, oh, yeah. So, recently, we trimmed weed for the first time. Oh, yeah. Um, at a, at um, Skyler's family, their place. What was that like for you for the first time? Like, what was your impression it of it? It was fun. It was fun? Yeah. Yeah. I loved it. It was just super relaxing. It was like super therapeutic and satisfying very satisfying it's very satisfying yeah, yeah we both loved it for sure yeah um, it was great it's just like we learned know, a lot i learned a lot it's just like mesmerizing doing it yeah we and learned. we found a bunch of caterpillars yeah the there weed. was tons of yeah. caterpillars caddy pillars yeah in this marijuana um mm. but no yeah we learned a lot about weed i didn't think we were gonna Mm-mm. like learn anything but no it was so fun. Super like fun. I want to do it all the time. Like I would do that. Like that, uh, for a full time job. Yeah. <laughs> no, I would too. I would too. It would be very fun, <laughs> and you would always be able to smoke. Um, yeah. That's sick. But definitely try it. Try trimming, guys. If you haven't, it's awesome. Yeah, it's nice. Do, do you have to be eighteen or? A de- I don't know. Is that legal? I don't. I, don't, I have no idea. But I have no idea. Yeah. Okay. But. Let's see. Um, oh, yeah. If you... Do you have any plants that you want to get? Do you think you have too many? Or are you going to get rid of some? <laughs> do you have dream plants? Well, I've been giving you a lot of them. Yes, you Because have. I've been spending more time at your house. Yeah. So I want your house to have plants, too. Yeah, yeah. exactly. And because I love them. Thank you so much. Honey. Yeah, because they do have benefits. Like, they benefit, like... They purify they, the air. Yes, dude, like, they do. They, like, literally make oxygen. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Definitely. And but, it's just nice to have But around. do you have dream plants? Like, certain species that you really want to get? Or hmm. colors? Hmm. I'm trying to think. Because we go in plant stores all the time, and you're always saying, like, I would get this. You pretty you say you would get pretty much everything. There's not, like, a plant yeah. you don't want to get. You're yeah, like, I love that. I love that. We go to Green Acres. <laughs> Skylar Green Acres. Yep. Well, there's not really one specifically I want right now. I'm trying to like not buy anymore. Yeah. And just like try to take it easy on the plants. Because you've been going hard, and yeah, and it gets more difficult to manage. You tell me. Right? It does. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I've had to make a lot of them like outside plants or i bring them to your house yeah that's true <clears throat> if someone wants to get into plants what is an easy to take care of one like do the levels you know of, um, of species aren't cacti the easiest and yeah i mean like a new plant is like pretty easy to take care of if you just like look up true. just like research like how like what it likes and what it doesn't like Right. And, like, just, it's literally, like, following the instructions. Yeah, it's not that hard. Yeah. Succulents, cacti <laughs> are the easiest, I feel like, though, right? Yeah. You have to water them much. at least. They don't really need sunlight. I mean, they, much. like, they do, like, a lot of water sometimes. A lot of water, yeah. It just depends. Yeah, it does. I don't know. 
Yeah. <laughs> Just um, peel it out. <laughs> yeah. Did you... When? Oh, yeah. Did it matter that I had green eyes? Were you attracted to me more? Because I also Definitely. Had your color? Definitely. Because it's the rarest color, if you guys don't know. Yeah. Right? I think, like, 2%. Of people. That is weird to think yeah. about. Yeah. It's just weird. Um, Halloween just went down. That was very fun. Yeah. We should talk about that. The yeah. summary. So yeah. explain what we did. Where we went. So I was a fl- I dressed up as a flapper. And Owen was a gangster. Yeah. And we went to Reno for the zombie crawl. And what else did we do? Um, we just met up with all of our friends. Mm-hmm. Ryko. Uh, or not Ryko. Ryko and Christian couldn't make it. But we met up with all of the friends from uh, Reno, like Brent and Joe. And yeah, yeah, Aiden was there, my brother. It was a very fun time. And uh, Will, uh, TC, Lauren, yeah. and her friends. Mm-hmm. It was very fun. It was really fun. Great time, great time. We took lots of photos. Yes. I loved your flapper costume. It was great. What do you want to be next year? Fairy. Yeah. Or maybe, like, um, 50s. Oh, yeah. We were thinking about doing 50s. That would be cool. That would be cute. Like a greaser. Yeah. That would be cute. Yeah, that would be cool. I'm very excited for the holidays. And we should do a Christmas-themed podcast. Yeah. Definitely. Definitely. Yeah. (laughs) Um, I can't wait to get your gifts. (laughs) Yeah. Um, I like giving gifts more than receiving gifts. And it's our first Christmas love, as a couple. Yeah. No, me too. I love giving gifts. I like, love, like, buying people stuff. It's my favorite. <laughs> watching their reaction yeah. is the best. Yeah. I love oh, it. it's so sweet. Yeah, you got, you got mine. Yeah. One, we're we're going to, so. yeah, we're going to get each other great gifts. It's going to be a great Christmas. Mm-hmm. And we should definitely ice skate. I want yeah. to ice skate at least once with you. Mm-hmm. That'll be very fun. Okay. Um, oh, yeah. This is uh, trending. This is a trending news thing um, that happened about like two weeks ago. I, I told you about it. Um, not to take a turn to the to dark news for the changing subject on the podcast right now. But it, I just want to bring it up and get your opinion on it as a girl. Just because it's like trending news that everybody's kind of talking about. But uh, if you guys don't know, there was an OnlyFans girl called uh, Amorith. Uh, Amoranth. <laughs> A- I, don't, I can't say the name. It's like Amorith, I think. I'm really bad at pronouncing it, so I apologize. Um, but Amorith. <laughs> Amoranth. I, I forget what it is. Okay, really, and this is so bad because it's... A bad story, and I'm disrespecting. I can't pronounce it. Oh, my it. God. But she, this OnlyFans <laughs> girl was basically, like, forced, essentially, to do it by her husband. And it's, like, a really sad story. And I it makes me wonder, like, how many other OnlyFans girls are like this. Like, basically, like, held hostage and just very toxically... Tos, toxically forced into doing only yeah. fans kind of just like yeah it's like scary what do you think about that like as a girl it's just like so weird it is scary yeah but yeah it probably happens more than people think yeah it mm-hmm. makes you wonder right like how many other only fans girls this tragic thing happen to them it's like yeah yeah it's pretty shocking um i feel it's bad really for sad him. and all girls that it's really sad yeah. well did he get caught yeah, yeah. She like exposed him mm. and shit, and like showed the DMs or something. Well, that's that good. He was getting basically all the money. That's good. Stuff like that. I want to say, yeah, really good. He was exposed. Yeah, it makes you wonder. It's like, yeah. Because well, the creepy thing is that like the world didn't know. Like, and she looks happy, right? Yeah. In the photos, it's like you She's, can't like, even smiling. tell. Yeah, and yeah. and like the trauma that was mm. going down. It's like. It's kind of like Marilyn Monroe, because we saw that documentary. Yeah. And well, yeah, just being a, a used. Little, it's a little similar. Like, well, how everyone thought she, her life was great, she was happy, but it's like she she had some tra- traumatic shit that was going down behind the scenes, yeah. right? That, like, the whole world, like, yeah. it wasn't visible. Yeah, mm-hmm. it's just shocking. Um, yeah, you never know. Yeah, you never know. 
But what do you think of Happy Dad, by the way? I love him. I like Happy Dad. Yeah. They're very good. We very just good. ran out, so that's why we have the coffee. <laughs> um, but, yeah, Sky and I get Happy Dad every now and then. Mm-hmm. Very, we change the subject very fast on the podcast. <laughs> um, but, oh, yeah, what do you think of the Jesse thing reaching out? That was awesome, huh? I was so excited for you. MTV Jesse, yeah, yeah. you were. And that's so another excited. thing. Like, you're the most supportive person ever. Oh, thanks. Yeah. We support... <laughs> I think that's what makes us... We both are. We're both very supportive. Yeah. That's what makes us great. Um, and that's what makes us work mm-hmm. as a relationship, as a couple. Where it's so important. It's crucial in a healthy relationship to, like... Yeah, definitely. Just have transparent communication and just, like... I feel like we just really get each other. And we I agree. Just, we click. We click. We were it's, crushing on each other. It's weird. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it is weird. And yeah. we both look back and we help each other and stuff. Yeah, and definitely. we both used to party too much, definitely, I feel like. And yeah. that's one thing we grew out of and matured yeah. with. Yeah, we're, we're like grandma and grandpa. Yeah. We're... <laughs> that's what we were talking about, right? Yeah. We're very grandma. Well, yeah. I mean, you're a super grandma. We're your grandpa. Here, his dad souls. jokes. I have horrible dad jokes. Your dad yeah. jokes. We're, I already <laughs> am acting like your baby dad. I'm not even prego yet. Yeah. Um, but, <laughs> wait, what were we just talking about? I don't know. I completely forgot. Yeah. <laughs> okay, we'll just change it at this. Oh, I saw, <laughs> what's your view, Skylar, on like social media as being like so strict and taking down... Like, YouTubers, they, they will get their videos, like, fucking, like, age-restricted and all that, mm-hmm. you know? Because YouTube's system is so weird and bad. Um, and they don't deserve it. Like, the video is completely innocent. Like, uh, you know that... Yeah, well, I feel like there are too many videos and, like, not enough people, like, screening them for, like, actual people to be, like going through all of them like it's probably like a robot oh, like no, yeah, going through a, all the videos you're and like right it's the them. ai that yeah just does it and then like so like it's not really like legit right right yeah yeah that's why it acts so shitty you're completely right yeah it's uh only if something pops up then the ma- then um, it will be, be manually manually checked yeah like it needs like a human yes like judgment they have employees yeah that yeah. do it but sometimes the employees make fucked decisions. But, like, there's just like, too much, like... There's so many videos. Too many yeah. videos and too not enough people. people yeah. Not enough time. Yeah. For people to be spending their entire life, like, just watching videos. Yeah. That's but very yeah. true. It does suck, but it's just, like, it is what it is at this point. Like... Yeah. There's no fix in it. We're not in control at all. Yeah. That's what, like, people forget. Like, yeah. it's like, we can't do fucking shit. It's a giant, giant Google-owned yeah. company. Mm-hmm. They will make their decision no matter what. Yeah. Yeah. Um, what, what's your, like, five-year plan as a person? Hmm. Or just, do you, what are goals that you want accomplished? Because uh, it's almost the new year. It is so. almost the new year. I want to find, like, a new, like, direction to go in. You know, like a new job in a new, Career. like, field. Yeah, a new yeah. field of workplace. Yeah. Yeah. yeah, so that's what I'm trying to figure out right now. That you enjoy? Yeah. Yeah, that you're actually into, yeah. Yeah. Well, that's good. I feel like you'll find it yeah. soon. Definitely. Yeah, but I've just been trying things, and eventually I'll find something that that stays. Yeah. It sticks. Yeah, exactly. Yeah. And I think you'll find it soon. I, I always tell you, it, uh, I think it comes when you least expect it, like yeah. something that you're... And we'll also probably get married in the yeah. next five years. Oh, Probably. Yeah, probably. Or 10 years. Yeah. Definitely. Um, (laughs) What are some of the favorite vacations that we've done so far? We've been to lots of places. Mm -hmm. We've been to Monterey together. What else? Monterey, Bodega Bay. um, 
Reno. Reno. Yeah, Reno. Where else? I think that's it. Right? No. We've been to way more places. Oh, Donner Lake. Oh, Donner Lake. Lake Ta- Tahoe. Tahoe, Napa. Oh, yeah, Lake Berryessa. Yep. Um, I loved uh, Bodega Bay and Monterey. Yeah. I think that's, what about you? Yeah. Are those your favorite? Yeah, I think um, Bodega Bay was my favorite. Yeah. I feel like we've been to one more beach together. Yeah, I know. We've been to so too many beaches to like handle. Yeah. In such a short amount of time that we've been dating and shit. Where else did we go? Napa, Tahoe. Um, yeah, I can't remember. But I loved Bodega Bay and the Monterey at the aquarium. Oh, yeah. Oh, San Francisco. San Francisco. That's it. Yeah. Yeah. We should go. What is an, what's our next vacation that do you hmm. think we should do? Like Fort Bragg or something? Yeah. That'd be really fun. Mm-hmm. Yeah. That'd be great. Yeah. I want to, like, save up and go somewhere, like, really cool. Yeah. We should go soon, like, on vacation. Yeah. That'd be great. Yeah. It's somewhere warm. Yes. Somewhere warm. <laughs> it's cool here mm-hmm. just to change it up. Yeah. Yeah. Do you think you'll... So, what's it like um, dating a YouTuber? Um, or not, I'm not, like, a YouTuber, but I just, like, I, um, I upload It's like you, I don't know, there's, like, no differences besides, like, you're just. Sometimes I just gotta. You have to edit done. and yeah. stuff, and you have to go on your phone and stuff. <laughs> yeah. That's, I like, try, the only but I, I'm pretty good with not pulling out the phone at dinner. Yeah. When we're out, right? That's yeah. good. Yeah. Because I try not to do that because that's like hella rude. I don't like that. Yeah, you are. You're really good. Okay, that's good. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Let's talk about um, restaurants and like what you enjoy. Um, So, Mukuni and I want to say, what else is your favorite? You love sushi. You love... uh, Yeah. What's the other fucking favorite restaurant of yours? I'm trying to think. Hmm. What else do I you mean, like? I mean, your favorite type of food is like sushi for the most part, right? Favorite restaurant. Labu has been my favorite recently. It's been yeah. one of my favorites. I've been loving Labu. Yeah. Yeah. Labu is the shit. Yeah. Just, it's, it's such, it's the most comfort food when it's raining. Yeah. Is it only in California? It's very small. I think it's chain. only Sacramento. Only Sacramento? Yeah. I, I think. think so. I also love hmm. the old spaghetti factory. Yes. That place I love is good. The old spaghetti factory. And I love That place is lit. Um Oh Burger Patch. Oh Burger my. Patch. Don't get is me so started good. about Burger Patch. <gasps> um Oh, I'm getting so <laughs> I'm getting so fucking hungry. Right I'm now. getting hungry too. <laughs> if you guys don't know, Burger Patch is uh, is a vegan restaurant uh, in Sacramento, mm-hmm. and most people do not even know it's vegan. Like, it, they don't market it that super obviously when mm-hmm. you're walking in from the outside, right? Mm-hmm. Like, you wouldn't even know. Amazing food. Mm-hmm. It's so good. Um, yeah. What else do we like? We we go to, like... Uh, We've been grocery shopping a lot recently. Yes, we, we have. We haven't really been going out to eat. We've been so good yeah, we've been about s- saving money. Yeah, we've been save money. We've been, like, the... mom and dad. Yeah. Playing house. Well, we're on a budget. Yeah, we, we want to yeah. make sure our money is going yeah. to towards We've been balling goals. on a budget. Yeah. Like, we're, like, cut the shit. We need to... Yeah plan and, and for our future dude you know who helped out like mtv jesse when he when he messaged me mm-hmm. he was like i'm doing very financially well and i don't even use uber eats that's what he told me yeah so it's like it's that's so, true because like so the true. most successful people like or not most successful but like i feel like if you have money like you're like more you know what it's worth more and you don't want to spend it as much because you like you have more to lose, I guess. <clears throat> yeah. <coughs> <coughs> I just inhaled coffee. That's great. That runs in my family, I swear to God. We <laughs> all do it. <coughs> we inhale our drink. Mm. Um, 
What else? Let's see. Is that all the mm. topics? Oh, how many tattoos do you have, and do you plan on getting more? Hmm, how many do I have? One, two, three. I think I have eight. You have eight? Yeah. How oh, many do you have? That's right. Oh, uh, counting my lip tattoo. I have two legs, three arms. I have six, right? One, two, three, four, five, six. Yep. I think I have six. Do you plan on getting more tattoos, Skylar Green? Um, yeah, definitely. Yeah, like where? Um, I want to get, I have like a fish on my ankle and I want to get another one like on the other side, but like oh, yeah. kind of opposite, Yeah. you know? And then you want to get more piercings, right? Yeah. Yeah. I think I'm probably going to wait. For piercings, like. yeah. 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 What was the most painful tattoo? The ones on your lungs? Yeah, my ribs, for your sure. Ribs, yeah. It was horrible. Because it's just yeah. like bare on like It's like muscle. right on your bone. Yeah, right like, on bone. Yeah. Like he was like for skinny people, like the ribs are the absolute worst. Like, yeah. Because it's right on there. Yeah. It was horrible. But... It wasn't, like, the worst pain ever, but it was pretty bad. Yeah, I feel that. Yeah. I I would be scared getting that. Like, that would be crazy. Mm-hmm. Super scary. What was your most painful? Um, maybe the lip. Yeah, for sure the lip or the sad boys one because it's almost on knee. Yeah. Like, right here, there's it's very tense. Yeah. It's like... So right there, or the lip, or tie, yeah. Mm-hmm. Um, let me see. I'm kind of running out of things to talk about. <laughs> hmm. Oh. Anything you want to t- talk about? Um, Panda Express has vegan orange chicken. Yes, Panda <laughs> Express. Thank you, Panda <laughs> Express. They have yes, the fucking we best. love Panda Express. We. I love Panda Express. I love it. I we're, fucking love we're it. We're addicted to it because they finally we're got beyond, addicted to it. beyond so orange good. chicken. It's so... Thank you. Ugh, it's so good. Yeah, because I'm a vegetarian. I like think... My life. Yeah, I need to... We have Panda too much. <laughs> yeah. We're going to turn into pandas. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> like that Pixar movie. <laughs> Dude, uh-huh. yeah, it was so good. Um, let's talk about your favorite type of music and your favorite type of movies Mm, i really like funny movies like uplifting like movies to make me feel good yeah pretty much it depends on my mood though well sometimes you do like you watch i have playlists you want to watch a scary movie though yeah sometimes and i feel like sad playlists i have like Playlist for every mood. So it just depends on the mood. Yeah. yeah I feel it like you're depends very... on my mood, definitely. Yeah. I don't really have one. I like pretty much all genres you, of music well, except like, me. like country. You're like, yeah, you're like me. We both don't like country music. I d- don't like country. And we both don't like musicals. Yeah, right? no. I don't yeah. like musicals. I fucking hate musicals. I mean, I don't like hate them. Like, I've, like, I've gone to some and I sat through like them. I, I don't like particularly or like see, them. Seeing it. Like I respect it. Like I can't sing, I can't dance and It is I, really it's, corny. It's difficult to do and I respect that people would do it, but I just personally my taste I cannot stand with them. Like I don't know why. It's hella corny. It it's really corny. <laughs> what are what are some of your favorite shows of all time? What do you think? Hmm. Have you have you seen like and have you, are there any shows that you've fully seen every single episode or like? Hmm. I watched The Office. I watched Breaking Bad. You loved Breaking Bad. Yeah, huh? that one was really good. Hmm. I don't know. I'm not really really into shows. Yeah. Recently. Oh, well, we, we watched the, the Hill House one. Oh, yeah, that The Haunting really of Hill House is so good. Haunting of Hill House. I horror, recommend that one. Yeah, horror movie on Netflix. Right? Yeah. No, it's a show, horror show. Hulu? Oh, sorry. On Netflix. Yeah. yeah, it's a Netflix show. 
Yeah, that was on Netflix. Super good. We loved that. Yeah, we, we loved really that show. Into it. Yeah. Wasn't there another it, one that your mom recommended to us that we watched? Oh. It was like a cult. It was like. Oh, perfect. Oh, nine perfect strangers, on Hulu. That one's good. That one was really yeah entertaining and like we. we I were, like that. It dude, sucks. That was a really good show. One. Yeah. That was a good show. That one was good. Yeah, um, I feel like I haven't seen that many good shows. Yeah, I loved uh, Lost. Oh, Walking Dead. Oh, we like Cutthroat Kitchen. Oh, Cutthroat Kitchen, and oh, Cut I throat. mentioned that on the uh, Connor's Connor, podcast. Yeah, on the Connor podcast, a few ones down, we just did. Yeah. Um, but dude, yeah, Cutthroat <laughs> Kitchen. Sky and I are fucking addicted. It's great. Mm-hmm. Why do you like watching it? Because it's fast paced. It's like not you can watch any episode and like it's not like you had to know what happened to the episode before. Yeah, exactly. It's like one of those type of shows. Exactly. So that's what I like about it. There's always new people on Yeah. It's always different and crazy and funny. It's funny yeah. sometimes. And the guy is like I like the way he narrates it. It's funny. Oh yeah. He's just He's goofy. Yeah. It's yeah. funny. It's a great yeah. show. Yeah. I wouldn't expect us to get into it. I so know. Much. Oh, what's the movie we watched last night? Oh. Oh, uh, Rat Race. It's a fairly old one, like 2000s or maybe 90s. I'm not too sure. But yeah, Rat Race. You love <laughs> that movie. Yeah, I was dying. <laughs> Dude, no, yeah. You broke. So you were almost funny. like crying. <laughs> Uh, great movie recommendation. So yeah. go watch that one. It has yeah. like lots of like big actors and actresses. On yeah. It, right? yeah, it was really funny. A lot of popular actors. Yeah. Um, but yeah, well, I just wanted to say like how how much you inspire me and like I hope you guys know that a lot of stuff I do it's so good because like I I run it by like this person right here. Aww. You know? Like, I feel like there's been so many times, like, just uh, intros, like, even designing clothing, like, just, like, anything for portraying, <laughs> it was, like, way better because I ran it by Skylar. Oh. And you, you just, you're really observant, and your your sense of, uh, let's talk about the, your sense of arrangement, and just, like, I feel like you're a very neat, tidy, clean person. You have a little bit of OCD, too, yeah. right? <laughs> yeah. Um, yeah. Y- were you always like that? Yeah. Yeah. Always. Like since always. a young age. Yeah. yeah. And another funny thing, you've always complained about the winter. You're not the biggest <laughs> winter person. I'm right? not a winter girl. Has it got you down recently? The rain? Yes. Yeah. Like I don't have as much uh, energy. Like... And I'm, I'm very different. I love no. every season. I prefer I'm summer. not a winter person. Yeah. I, I... prefer summer, but... That doesn't mean I'm not a winter person. Yeah. It's... I love summer. Summer is my vibe. Well, we did spend all of our time, like, last summer tanning. So Yeah. Yeah. We were super into that. Mm Mm-hmm. Yeah. Um, Oh, I want to just say, like, you're... Before we were even friends or dating, I noticed, like, how amazing your instagram looked really you know yeah it was just really really aesthetic really neat tidy great photos i thought you looked so gorgeous and it was just but i thought like the the quality of like you knew what were like good ones and even just just like the colors of your outfits and stuff like that like did you thank you yeah like are you interested in, in modeling or photography you're you're into I, photography it interests me yeah i like it but i don't know if i would like do anything yeah like pursue well you don't know if it's like modeling it could be something else like cause yeah it's really good with like colors and just like yeah yeah i feel like you're very stylish you're into clothes i feel like we're both into clothes just as much yeah like, definitely that's one of our similarities yeah as a couple yeah yeah I think, I don't know. I don't have any other stuff to talk about. Do you? No, I think we should wrap it up. Yeah, I feel like we're both very tired. Huh? Yeah. Okay, and I'll edit this part out. Okay. Okay, sweet. 
Um, well, thank you guys. Um, we're going to actually wrap it up. Yeah. Because yeah, we're very tired. It's pretty late for us. Uh, we've had a long day, but we it's still wanted to fit in day. this pod. I think it was long enough. We covered yeah. a lots of different stuff. Yeah. Um, and was, we set the record straight. Yeah. We, from I, our last podcast. We, we redeemed ourselves. We redeemed ourselves for sure. Um, yeah. It was so exciting having <laughs> my girlfriend on yes. the pod. Thank you for having me, of honey. Of course. Um, I love you. I love you, too. <laughs> Do you want to plug your Insta or not? My Instagram is Skylar Green underscore S K Y L E R. If it's not that, it's a fake, yeah. fake account. Fuck all those bots. Yeah, yeah. fake account. Yeah. Boo. Boo. Fuck you guys. Scammers. <laughs> Cat, what do you call them? Catfish? Catfish? I don't know. But th- thank you guys so much for watching. Love you guys. Yeah, we love you. Um, oh, I love you. Thank you, Skylar. The love of my life. Great. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I hope you learned a lot about her and a lot about me. Uh, drop a thumbs up. Drop a comment down below. Get on the site, poetreg.com, sticker packs, art on there. Um, if you want to support the show, and this has been a great, great time. Great podcast. I'm very excited. Oh, yeah, definitely follow us on, on Instagram. Um, mine's Owen underscore Duff and at Poetreg Podcast. If you want to follow it for the daily clips, um, we're going to be posting on there quite a lot. Yeah. And... Bye. Bye. We'll thank see you. you. Yeah, thank you for watching <laughs> and staying if you stayed. And we'll see you next week. Yeah, see you next time. Deuces. Bye. Woo. Yeah, good job, honey. That was great. Great job. I love you. It was great. It was good. That was yeah, good. it was awesome. <laughs>